Hello guys, I'm Henry from Refugio 507 and if you're here you probably watched our previous video where I explained how to install mods on Beat Saber using the program Mod Saber Installer. The problem is that that program isn't really working anymore after the update of April 1st. The method I'm going to show you on this video isn't really ideal but it will definitely work. But for now we just need to wait for modders to come up with a better method. So let's get on it. So the first thing you want to do is go to the link of the Beat Saber modding guide that I pasted on the description of the video. Then you need to download this program and install it on the install folder of Beat Saber. This would be the default locations of Oculus and Steam and these are the locations if you install them on a different drive. Another thing you can do if you're using Oculus is just go to the game and go to details and you will find the path right here and you can just paste it on your file explorer. Now go ahead and paste the contents of the zip file you just unloaded inside the BitSaber install folder. Then go ahead and run the IPA software and this screen will show up and then you can just press any button to exit out of it. Now you'll find that there's a folder called plugins inside the BitSaber install folder. Now you need to go to the link I pasted on the description of the video where you'll find all the mods you'll need. I recommend downloading and installing every file that appears on the dependencies section. Just go ahead and copy the link and paste it on your browser and it will automatically start downloading it. Once you install all the files of the dependencies section, go ahead and install all the mods you want by doing the exact same process. Now you can go ahead and extract all the contents of the zip files and put all the plugins inside the plugins folder of BitSaber. One of the zip files also has a custom songs folder that you'll want to put inside the BitSaber installation folder. Now you can open BitSaber and you'll see that a black screen with text on it will show up. It will just take a few seconds loading and then Beat Saber will open up. The mods will be there the first time you open Beat Saber. However, you'll need to close Beat Saber, go to the Plugins Unknown folder and copy and paste all the mods again inside the Plugins folder. You'll only need to do this once after the first time you open the game. If you don't do this, the mods are not gonna be there the next time you open the game. Since this is just a temporal method, you'll see that the buttons of each mod just say quit instead of the actual name of each mod. But don't worry, the mods are gonna be there and you'll be able to access custom songs, avatars, sabers and any other mods you decided to download. I will also leave on the description of this video the link for the custom avatars mod since it doesn't appear on the list I previously gave you. That would be all guys, remember this is not a really good method but it's all we've got right now. We just need to wait for modders to come up with a better method, I'm sure they'll figure it out soon. Well guys, if you found this video useful, don't forget to press the like button and subscribe to our channel. Thank you so much for watching, don't hesitate to ask any question you have and see you next time.